What's up, guys? NFL Talk. Uh, Sunday football. We have a couple of games going on. Uh, currently, right now, we have the 49ers behind me versus the Cowboys. Uh, we had a pretty good games. Interesting games, surprising games to, uh, today. So, I'm going to just try to go through them as quickly as I can. So, here it is. We have the Buffalo Bills versus the New England Patriots. The Buffalo Bills kept the New England Patriots scoreless. Scoreless. Uh, and it's being said that this is the first time since 1993, at least around that time, since um, the Patriots were kept scoreless, which is good job defense. Rex Ryan's coming through. Um, Buffalo Bills win 16-0. A good testament. Um, they're starting to pick pick up steam. Uh, last week they won a game, um, and now they won a game again with good defense and a little bit good offense as well, which I will get into right now. Uh, Tayron Taylor, uh, who is not usually go for the uh, pass so much, he he went for a lot. He went for thirty nine passes attempts. He got twenty seven. Uh, completions, 246 yards, and a passing touchdown, which is pretty damn good for Tayron Taylor, which is he, he doesn't often go for those big yardage. He usually goes for short passes um, and for some running, which he still did. He still did that, uh, but he kept it balanced. It was a good balance on offense, so pretty good damn job for Tayron Taylor. Um, the receivers, oh, you got Woods with seven receptions, 89 yards. Clay with 47 yards, five receptions. Um, uh, McCoy, uh, six receptions, 38 yards, and a couple others too who are above 10 yards as well. So you have a whole bunch of guys with big yardage all down the line. So once again, good job for Tyron Taylor who did a good job for this, uh, um, uh, McCoy, um, 19 carries, 70 yards, um, not too good, but, uh, decent enough, I would say, decent enough, he gave them something, um, Tayron Taylor also, uh, carried some balls, too, uh, 28 yards overall, yardage, sorry, um, the defense was pretty damn good, uh, they got, uh, couple of sacks going on like one two three I'm seeing here three three sacks a couple of um good tackles especially from Brown this boy Brown he did good so that's it for the Buffalo Bills um New England um Bressett uh had 17 completions out of 27 attempts 205 yards he didn't throw no interceptions but he felt weak um I feel like he was hurt this entire game. Of course, he was. There was speculation whether he's going to play or not because his, I believe, his dumb injury. Uh, but it seemed like something else was wrong with him, especially around the second and third quarter, uh, where they were held scoreless. Obviously, throughout the entire game, especially them, uh, it just felt like he was kind of hurt. Especially there was one play where he went down. Uh, he stood there for a little minute, and then he got up. He felt a little bit wobbly. He felt off, in my opinion. So, good thing this is his last game because Tom Brady is coming back. So, it's going to be a wrap. They did their job. New England, uh, Jimmy J. Jimmy G, sorry. Jimmy G and this boy Brisket. Uh -huh. I don't know if I'm pronouncing his name right, but I'm calling him Brisket. Uh, this boy Brisket. And Jimmy G, uh, they did their job. They kept it afloat. They're going in 3-1. and one. Pretty good job. Um, let's look at the receiving. Uh, Bennett, five receptions, 109 yards. Pretty good. Uh, you got this boy White with 50 yards. Uh, Elliman with 16 yards. Um, Bolden with 15 yards. And you got this boy... Rob Grankowski back. He only had one reception though. Uh, 11 yards. 
Uh, you have um, for the rushing blunt, fit thirteen carries, fifty four yards, and your boy Brisket again, four carries, twenty three yards. White four carries, twelve yards, and one thing from Yellowman. Element, sorry. Um, one thing about the offense though is that there was a lot of fumbles. There was a lot of turnovers going. Well, one turnover, but a lot of fumbles, a lot of loose balls. So they need to take care of that ball. Um, a couple from the quarterback, a couple from the receivers. So they need to take care, take care of that ball. Really good. Um, the defense they got two sacks in. And a, and a pretty good number of tackles. So they weren't whack. They weren't bendable. They were doing a pretty good job on defense. It's just that there were some instances where they got through, unfortunately. But but it's all good. So that's pretty much it. Um, New England goes 3-1. and one. Uh, They split the division. Uh, one win, one loss, and Buffalo goes up. One win, one wall, one loss, but they're still two and two, so they're they're right behind New England. So they're trying to keep Rex Ryan's job alive. Good for them. So that's it. Um, I'm gonna talk about the Jets versus the Seahawks next because I think they're they're in the same division, the Jets. So peace out, guys. Patriots lost, but Tom Brady is coming back next. So, we're in for a long day, a long season when he come back.